Who knows all the countries in the world or even knows the basics about those countries? That's why I made this small series to give you at least a brief overview of the most important data on their political system. And I include countries of all sizes we have. And today is about San Marino. The official name of the country is Republic of San Marino or Repubblica di San Marino. The form of government is a republic. The head of state are two councillors, Capitani Regenti, who are in office every six months, represent each other and are elected by parliament. Inauguration is always on April 1st and October 1st of each year. In office from um, in uh, April to no October to April until 2020 was Luca Boschi and Mariella Mularoni. The foreign minister was Luca Beccari, state secretary for foreign and political affairs and justice since December 2016, at the same time head of government as a primus inter pares, thus de facto head of government. On the Human Development Index, there are no numbers for San Marino. San Marino is an enclave in the Italian Republic, 20 kilometers south of Rimini, 10 kilometers from the Adriatic coast. San Marino has been independent since the 12th century. The political system of San Marino is that of a parliamentary representative democracy. It was enshrined in the San Marino Constitution, the oldest republican constitution in the world, by the way. The national holiday, the day of the founding of the Republic, is celebrated on September 3rd. The parliament consists of the Grand and General Council, Consiglio Grande e Generale, with 60 members who are elected for five years. The last elections in 2016 resulted in a coalition government made up of two liberal parties, the Civico Dieci and Repubblica Futura, and a left-wing party, the Sinistra Socialista Democratica, and the opposition consists of the Christian Democrats, the PDCS, the Party of Socialists and Democrats, the PSD, the Socialist Party, the Movimento Civico, RETE, and other small parties. The GDP is 1.62 billion US dollars, and the GDP per capita is 62,900 US dollars, just to give an imagination of the well-being of the people, depending on their sides. I'll see you in my next video. Auf Wiedersehen.